I think the hardest part of preaching is it's one to many. Mm. And so it's like the opposite of spiritual direction in that sense. It is a form of discipleship. It is a form of spiritual direction, but it's, it's one to many. And I think the greatest challenge at many levels, more difficult than exegeting the text, more difficult than exegeting the culture, is realizing that different people in that church need to hear different messages mm. at a sense. And based on all sorts of things mm. from their gender to their introvert extrovert to their Enneagram type or Myers Briggs yep. type to their ethnicity to their mm. church background to have they been wounded by the church or wounded by secularism? Are they new convert? Have they been around, you know, for decades? That's I think the most difficult task. It's why I think the difference between a good teacher and a great one is mm. nuance. Mm. Learning to speak to those different types of people in different types of ways. But at the end of the day, you nuance as much as you can, but you can nuance too much, and then a sermon loses its power. It's like it's kind of dulling the blade a little Absolutely. bit. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. and it's like people get lost in the, wait, what exactly? 